Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be this week's grocery haul along with some of my meals and snacks that I'm going to be having this week. Instead of adding straight granola into my yogurt parfaits, I really like using this cereal and it has everything and more that you could honestly imagine. It's perfect. I only picked up one grapefruit this time around. My fruit bowl was pretty empty, so I definitely wanted to fill it up with lots of yummy treats. I like to get bananas and different stages of their ripening process, so that way they last a lot longer throughout the week. Tuna is one of my favorites, so I definitely made sure to stock up on this. I love to throw a can into my salads. It's a great alternative to using chicken or shrimp. And I also got a couple cans of black beans. Again, I love to throw this in my salads. You guys will see a little bit later. And then this is my go-to dressing. It's so good. It pretty much goes with any type of salad that you want to make. Um, and along with my salads, of course, I had to get my lettuce. And as you guys know from my vlogs, this is my favorite blend to pick up. Every time I go to the market, I have to pick up broccoli. It's such a staple for me in my diet. And of course, tomatoes. You can use these for anything. Citrus fruit is always a good thing for me to have around because I'm prone to getting sick. So vitamin C is great. So I just picked up a nice bag of these beauties and I'm just gonna fill it up in my fruit bowl. And I like to see my fruit because then I'm more you know, prone to eating it when I see it right in front of me. Green onions are great to have around to add extra flavor to your food. And I also picked up a bag of frozen mangoes. I saw that they were back in stock at the store and got really excited about it. And then I got a ton of yogurt, you guys. I love Greek yogurt and they have a nice variety of different flavors to choose from. Brown rice, again, is another staple in my diet, so I had to get some more of that. I also picked up a little bit of this Mexican blend of cheese, and I got some chicken as a protein source this week. So you guys will see how I prepare this in a second. So here are some meal and snack options that I'm going to be having throughout the week and I love to make these little veggie bowls and I like to stash them in the fridge so I can grab them whenever I want them and I have some ranch parmesan dressing right here so it's pretty low calorie but I just keep them in the fridge and they're great snacks to have. You can take them to school and work as well. One thing that I like to do is bake my chicken ahead of time because it saves me a lot more time whenever I want to eat dinner and I'm just too lazy. So the seasoning that I chose to go with for these meals is just a basic lemon pepper. So you can buy little grinders from the market that already have everything in there um, for the flavoring. But I also just tossed in a little bit of olive oil and then the rest of it was just the chicken juices. So I like to pair these with brown rice and some sort of a green vegetable like French green beans, broccoli, asparagus, things of that matter. So you can see that I'm just separating this and then I'll store these in the fridge and these are my dinners for the next three days. For the remaining chicken, what I like to do is slice them up and then store them in another Tupperware container. This way, when I go to make salads for lunch, I already have my protein source ready to go and I like to have it nice and chilled. So this is perfect, especially if you guys want to take your lunches with you to work or school. And finally, I wanted to share with you guys my lunch today, which was a Mexican style black bean salad. It's a really yummy, easy salad to make, and it's just different and a lot more flavorful than a basic boring salad. So all these ingredients you saw me haul earlier in the video, but I have some sliced tomatoes. I have some green onions here. You don't have to use this many. I just really like green onions in my salad. It adds a really great bit of flavor. And I have here a can of black beans. I'm only using about half of a can. They are cooked and I also rinsed them and drained the juices. And on top of that, this is my little secret. I have about a palm full of crushed tortilla chips. They're gluten-free and they're corn tortilla chips. Really crunchy and it adds a nice bit of flavor to the salad as well. And I'm also going to add in a little bit of that Mexican blend of cheese. So 
So that's it for this week's grocery haul and the meals that I will be having throughout the week. Thumbs up this video if you enjoyed it because I would love to make more of them and thanks so much for watching.